Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Milky Plays, Skies of Arcadia Legends. We last left off, we were just going through the dark rift a little bit. And we've been exploring somewhat. Ended up finding the Chalice of Blood from Mr. Zivlin Bane, who we've seen a, quite a few times by now. Now, before I head off, I need to check my theory. If I can go up above, can I go down below? Oh, I sure can. I wonder. I wonder, I wonder, just where I'm headed. Into a random encounter, of course. Get the jump on these guys. Just going to result in a fairly quick battle, I think. Oh yeah, super quick. Done. That was fun. Oh God, don't tell me. Oh, I just went out. To the beginning again! Rah. Why? And you only find out that you've made it that far when it's too late. <laughs> Yeah, shoot beams out of your sword like Link. And Zelda's a pretty cool guy. Fights cannons and doesn't afraid of anything. You know what, that Moonberry makes this all worth it. I'm quite fine with Moonberries. Well, at least I know where I'm kind of sort of going. Huh. 
At this point, the random encounters are just getting a little tedious. They just shook. All it did was like wave its dangly mossy bits in Nice's face and it apparently hurt a lot. This, uh, not that weakening her attack would even really do much. It's not very strong to begin with. go. I'll find my way out of here, no problem. Hold on. Not quite done yet. So to God, I'm just gonna rain the swords these guys. Silence. Not that I think they use a lot of magic anyway, but ha! Over there. Now dead. Ha. That flat fiend has flatlined, oh. as has that one. That one's gonna poison everybody because it's a jerk. Yeah. is not going to kill anything, of course. Rain of Swords will take care of these things quite handily. Especially since they seem intent on healing themselves. Oh, why the hell are we watching this again? Should have skipped it. So I'm convinced that I want to fly up, not down. I know the NPCs were dropping hints on how to figure your way through here, but I'm just not picking up on any patterns or anything. Maybe it's just me. Maybe you guys watching out there and internet land have figured something out that I just haven't or maybe you already know something that I just don't remember. Uh, either way, the Dark Rift isn't particularly long. If you know where you're going you can get through it pretty quickly. The whole point is that you're not supposed to really know where you're going.
Take this. That wasn't so bad. Take another level up, though. I suppose that's fine. So that's probably where I want to go. Maybe. Yeah, I'm thinking yes. Got all these super moves that we can learn. Uh, no, I can't do that one. So, I can counter attack for everybody. I can damage all enemies on screen with an explosion. Or, Silver Moonlight cleanses all allies of any adverse ex effects except unconscious. We'll go with Lambda Burst, because Aika actually hasn't learned Super Move in a long time. Let's see if I was right. I better friggin' be right. I don't want to be wrong. Okay, I was right. <laughs> oh, you guys again. Oh, of course, these guys again, though. I'm not sure what I would expect otherwise. Yeah, go ahead and poison me, you jerk. Yeah. Well, I think I'm gonna lamb to burst you guys. I should have done it. I think I get eight spirit points at the beginning of a battle. If I could can just lambda burst everything to death, I don't see why I need to waste my time with these things anymore. Have at ye! What a dapper gentleman. I might end up lambda bursting just one enemy, but at least we'll get to see it. Fire consume my enemies indeed. That is what I'm gonna just launch every battle in this stupid rift with. missed something in here. Oh no, I don't even believe. I know I missed something in here. Welp. I'll have to go back and look for it later. I'm not overly worried. Well, we're just going to fight that funny looking thing that you must have noticed on our way in. Rawr! Come on, punk. What is that thing? 
I don't know, but it's this is probably its home. It doesn't look like it's gonna let us leave without a fight. No shit, eh? Let's see. Ah, oh, Charlie bit me. Now I evasive action, as if it's gonna do us a lot of good. Eh, ducks into its little swirly hole there. Which doesn't help me none. Oh, poked its head out just in time. Preparing an attack. What's it gonna do this time? Whatever it's gonna do, I'm I'm actually ready for it this time. Poison spray. Unfortunate. Don't think you can actually poison a ship though, so thankfully don't have to deal with that. I swear, awaiting orders. Tell us what to do, Captain. Stay put and keep shooting. Hold back a little. Let's keep shooting it. it. Might take some damage, but stay put and keep shooting at that thing. Good idea. If we move around too much in this place, it's so dark we might lose sight of the target. Damn right it's a good idea. I'm full of them. Chipping off its health, one attack at a time. I don't even know what the fuck this thing is. It's like an eel, obviously. You know, it's some fantasy eel. That makes no real sense. Just shoot a moonstone right into its little hole. Look at this dangly bit just flailing around like, ah, oh, shit. You're gonna have to do better than that, punk. Prepared an attack and then what, ducked into the hole? I guess for that one round if I had decided to shoot it, I probably would have missed. So I'm pretty sure that when it's ducked in like that, I'm not able to hit it at all. It keeps disappearing into that vortex. I can't keep a lock on that thing. It's impossible to hit it while he's hiding in there anyway. How can you expect to hit it if you can't see it? Thanks for that, Tips. I already figured that one out. Still two and good for health, so I'm not overly worried about getting my ass handed to me too much. Evasive action, uh-huh. Unfortunately, we're not going to try and attack you yet, you dick. And <laughs> now it's like, oh no. Which is... Kind of silly, because now we're both just bracing ourselves. Mm. 
missed it. That's unfortunate. Doesn't look like either action is going to, uh... Give me my Moonstone Cannon, so we'll pull back a little this time. Getting closer to tank. Tech from far away, he says. Get closer, he says. Jeez, I wish you'd make up your mind. Hey, I got my moonstone cannon, so quit your bitching. This is what I wanted. This is what I needed. Moving back seems to have done some good for me. At least now it's going to have a hard time hitting us. Yeah, you go ahead and prepare your attack. I'm going to destroy you. not dead. There are like actual airships that have taken fewer of those and died. Ooh, 3,170. That one actually hurt a little bit. Come on then, you patsy. Ho ho, it's coming out. Aren't you fancy fancy? Look, it's coming out of the vortex. Looks like our attack forced it out into the open. Now's our chance. Now's our chance, apparently. I'll do just fine. I hit it with a torpedo, and now it's very likely to actually be hit, so... I mean, it is pretty thin and wiggly. you think that would be very difficult to hit, actually. Still not dead. Come on, you little bastard. Oh. <laughs> Great, it went back inside. Oh well. I was hoping we could pull off a few more shots before it decided to hide again. Let's see if my same trick will work. Well, it might annoy Ica, but... Oh, I can't actually find... 
No. Fine. I'm just gonna launch everything I can at the stupid bastard. Hope to God it dies. Yeah, sure, duck into your little hidey hole. I'm shooting a torpedo anyway. Don't you duck inside again. I'm not going to enjoy it if you do. Bam. And for once it doesn't explode into a ball of fire. We just legitimately murdered that creature. Got a heavy torpedo, a timing valve, and a concussion bomb though, so that's not bad. I don't think there is anything here. So let's keep going. Only got a few minutes left in the episode, so one way or the other, we are out of here. Now I know we're not just at the beginning again. Not after all of that. We did it! We actually made it through the Dark Rift! Well, I can't believe that we are actually going to be able to see what lies at the east of the Dark Rift. We're making history as we speak. We're on the other side. Ha! <laughs> ha. So where exactly am I going? We seem to be coming to a point here. But I guess, yeah, I can go through the sky rifts, just not the dark sky rifts. No, 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 no. We're going to land a burst. And that'll be the end of the episode, no doubt. Although they do seem to be very keen on dragging this out. Oh wow, that didn't kill a single one of them. Got close. Hey, they. That was some weird slowdown. I guess we got too much going on. Well, unfortunately this episode's over anyway, so I will have to catch you guys in the next episode when we uh, explore a little bit of this continent of the Blue Moon. I hope to see you then. Goodbye for now.